Welcome to the Winner's Corner. Today's video is about winning. The winning mentality stay and see how you could become a winner. my people if this is the first time that you're here at this channel my name is alex and i'm a teacher but i'm also a motivator and i want to be a coach so subscribe follow for more videos like this one today we're talking about the winning mentality and i'm actually going to take this off um, actually to this whole week in our school was spirit week uh, yesterday we did uh, Tropical Tuesday and today was Winning uh, Winner Wednesday. So here's the big, big here's the big get up here for me today. I was just pumping people up and just cheering on my students. We're still doing online learning, by the way, and uh, and I'm here in my room and my desk, and that's how I do these videos. But I did want to share with you a couple of ideas of the winning mentality. Okay, and here's the deal. Okay, I know that uh, we don't have sports right now. Uh, there's not a lot of sports things going on, but if you have seen obviously some sports, you see that the main, the main, the main factor of a person who wins is not is the skill. Obviously, they have to have some skill, but it's the winning mentality. Why did they get the skill? Is because they worked on it. Okay, they worked on it, and it wasn't until they decided that they were going to win, they were going to put some effort into things that they pushed and they went out there to win. If you hear like uh, sports figures, one of the biggest things they say is, I'm the best, Muhammad Ali, he was like, I'm the best, nobody can beat me. And maybe, maybe, maybe somebody could beat him, but he said it, he, from the inside, he believed that he was the best. There's other figures, basketball players, uh, great ones, I know Kobe Bryant, you know, sadly he passed away this year, but if you remember, he was always, to the last day, he was always out there to win. And different figures in baseball and in, in soccer. I'm wearing the Argentina jersey. Check it out, check it out. Look, I even have my name on it. Check it out. See it? You see my name? Ah, ah, there you go, there you go. You see my name? That's cool. But even if you see the, uh, Messi, a plane, Argentina plane, the big figures, Cristiano Ronaldo, if you like soccer, you guys know who I'm talking about. These are people that they don't give up, they don't relent. They know what they want and they go after it and they get it. And they're always up there, up there challenging others, but ultimately really challenging themselves to become better. So here's what, here's how we could take it, how you and I could take this, okay? The one thing that you cannot do is put yourself down. For example, if, if you can't use negative words against yourself, if you say for yourself, oh, I'm so dumb, I'm so stupid, I don't know how to do something, Ultimately, maybe it's true. I'm not even saying that it's not true. Maybe uh, not that you're dumb, but I'm saying like maybe something is hard for you. Something is difficult. But the more you say that it's difficult, the more difficult it will be. Versus you flip it and you say, yes, it might be hard right now, but I'm going to work hard. I'm going to win. I'm going to go forward. I'm going to push. I'm going to become better. And that is the winning mentality that you need to have in order to win at whatever it is that you have going for you, okay? Uh, this channel is called Breaking Through. And it doesn't matter what it is that you're going against or trying to break to the next level. I'm here to try to motivate you and coach you, but you have to do it for yourself as well. You have to be your first motivator. You have to do it for yourself. So here's what I want you to practice, okay? Number one, I want to say, I want you to say something about yourself that's really positive, okay? Something that you know is true. So you're gonna have to search inside of you and say, okay, I know that I'm good at this. I don't know, I'm gonna make it up. I'm, I'm good at juggling, I'm not, but let's say I'm, I'm good at juggling, okay? I'm good at juggling and I'm, you're great at that. Whatever it is, you're great. So you say, you know what, I'm great at this. I am great, I am the number one and I'm gonna even get better. That, just that alone, that confidence in whatever it is that you're good at already can transfer into anything else. So here's the second thing that I want you to do. Once you find something that you are good at and then you can say, hey, I'm good at this. I want you to transfer that and just start saying the same thing about other things that maybe are not true. For example, if you're having trouble with a specific topic in school, for example, I know I hear this a lot. This is actually a perfect example. I hear people in math saying, oh, I hate math or, or you know, I can't do math. Math sucks. I'm, no, I'm, not, good. I'm not good at that. Um, keep, if you keep saying that negative thing, it keeps, it's almost like a, a self-fulfilling prophecy. 
So again, I'm not saying that you, you might be, I mean, it might be tough for you. I'm not, I'm not negating that. I'm a math teacher. I know that some students do struggle with that. But what I want you to say is, you know what? Uh, I'm going to get better at math. I'm going to get better. I'm going to be good. I know I'm going to understand this. I'm going to listen, focus and understand this. And this goes with anything. If you want to learn the piano, you're going to say, you know what? I'm going to be the best piano, the pianist out there. I'm going to learn the guitar. I'm going to be the best guitar out there. I'm going to be the best soccer player out there. I'm going to go and I'm going to do it. I'm, I'm, I'm going to go out there. I'm going to win. And that's the winning mentality that is going to cause you to win. Again, I know it's crazy, but it's, it's a self-fulfilling prophecy. The number one person that you need to convince is not anybody else. I know we focus on a lot of people. We want people to like us and people to, to support us. But the number one person that you have to convince is yourself. So today, today, I want you to say some encouraging words about yourself. Uh, think positively and just have that winning mentality that you're going to win, that you are the best because you are. You have a gift. I don't know what it is because I don't know you personally, but listen, I'll work with you. We could find it together. And ultimately, ultimately, you know that I'm here for you, cheering you on, cheering you on, saying, yeah, you can do it. You can do it. All right. And I know you can do it. You can do it because you have that winning mentality from this day forward. You will have that winning mentality. Thank you for being here at this video. We'll do more videos, more motivational videos. I hope you can like and subscribe and tag somebody. Share this video with somebody that you know needs to hear this. I'll catch you on the next video. In the meantime, keep breaking through.